Good morning. Time for a reality vlog. We like to just sometimes share our week with you. The reality of living here in Phuket. I'm going to share, wait till this Jeep drives past. Good morning. Yeah, we're just going to share some reality through the week. What we're doing in the background, because if we're not making videos, we're always doing something else to do with this place, Maybell's Coffee Garden. And I'm going to run a few things by you guys, because how we came up with this name of our business, Maybell's Coffee Garden, was by asking our YouTube subscribers to give us some ideas. And yeah, I think we should do more of that. Get you guys involved. I'm going to run by some of the things we're working on in the background. So let's carry on. Let's, let's start the week, shall we? If you're new here, I'm Richie. And Maybell. We're here sharing our journey, starting a new life. And a new business. Here in Phuket, Thailand. Yes. So if you're interested in Phuket, Thailand and all it has to offer. Please subscribe. And follow our journey. And enjoy the show. <laughs> Good morning, Mabel. Good morning. Can you tell us the reality of owning a plastic cherry blossom tree? Let's have a look at it. It's looking a little bit worse for wear now, right? Yeah. What's happened? One year now. And what's happened? It's changed. No, it's changed. It's melting away. This side gets the sun look melted away. But hey, don't worry, we'll, we're going to fix it, aren't we? We wait this one until it grow up big. Oh, wait for this one to grow up big and then we're going <laughs> to swap pots. Bergenville is popping there. I'm not sure if I've shared this yet. Good morning. Morning, boss. Morning. 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 Okay, we should definitely share this because the reality is doing this to YouTube, uh, some dickheads come along quite often in the comments and leave negative crap. You know, it's like useless. I've blocked a few just lately because oh, it's getting it's getting old. Like some of the same guys have been commenting on the channel shit comments for two years and I usually leave that leave it there like you put out this crap into the world you leave your crap there for everyone to see but just lately I thought I'm I'm bored of it goodbye if you leave crap here you will be blocked just go away but then on the plus side is something amazing happens people come into your life through this YouTube and do absolutely amazing things and thank you to the guy that bought this for us and thank you to the other guy that gave us some money that really helped us in the time of need you know some people wouldn't share this information but I'm sharing it I really thank you and I'll tell you what what we're doing with the business with somebody's help and someone we now have a commercial fridge that we really needed some people come in are just a blessing in your life and the other keyboard warriors you just stay at home yeah and type crap because you're you, you have no effect on this world whatsoever i see you dance come on yeah. <laughs> he's dancing behind me i see you yeah. come on no 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 <laughs> <laughs> Maybell in action. <laughs> you can still make an awesome coffee out of a flat white, please. Thank you. Okay. Let's see, have you still got it, Maybell? Can you still make a mean flat white? The most amazing flat white. Wow. Delicious. Ten out of ten. Thumbs up. Okay, it's breakfast time. Breakfast I'm time. I'm now allowed to eat it because Maybell has just been doing her Done photography. <laughs> Maybell is a new photographer here in Maybell's Coffee Garden. And what have you been working on in the background, babe? We're making the new menu. New menu. Took all the pictures, everything. Yeah, it's finished. It's finished already. But it's that hard work, that eh? Photograph every dish put it all into a menu yeah and then now all we need to do is get it printed and laminated eh coming soon well done good work 
<laughs> and another thing, uh, I think I mentioned it in there, <clears throat> is we are now registered a business, registered yeah. as a business. I'm looking at the sign now. And I have my work permit for director. I'm the director. <laughs> Am I? Big boss. <laughs> <laughs> it's Eid. That's Eid. Mm. Today is all about the coffee shop. Yeah. The next thing that we are planning, we're going to share and give us some ideas. What do you think? We cancelled barbecues for now because of the low season, low season, but they're coming back in high season and we want them to come back with live music. I'm going to show you now the plan and give us your suggestions. What else? Barbecues will be every Saturday night and maybe we can have music during the daytime. Yeah. Okay, the plan. This is. Tell us the plan. We're going to open this back bit up. The two cottages here, we're going to move over. Yeah. Move to the end there. No more, no more motorbikes parked in the garden. And here, we can build a stage. We can have yeah. the love heart somehow at the side of it. The love heart needs new flowers, I know. <laughs> it's looking a bit messy. And we're gonna have a, a stage for live music. We, we did Paddy's barbecue, you know, we realized when there's a show on, like the cabaret show, there's focus to watch and there's a reason to stay and be here for the whole evening. Yeah. And maybe the whole day, we might do daytime, but yeah, that's the idea. We're going to have live music when we come back to doing the barbecue and we'll have more area for the barbecue as well then. So that's the plan so far. Uh, yeah, tell us what you think, guys. Any ideas what we could have? Any <laughs> singers out there want to <laughs> offer their services? Come along and let's get some, uh, what's, what do we call it? We'll do some rehearsals in Maybell's Coffee Garden. Yeah. Yeah. I think now we can share some numbers. We haven't done this for a while. Maybell's giving me a funny look. We're going to share some numbers from Maybell's Coffee Garden. For the people that think we survive only on vloggers. Co yeah. What's your mouth? <laughs> <laughs> okay, Maybell, it's time to crunch some numbers. So, in the beginning of our cafe coffee shop journey, we used to share the books, didn't we? Yeah. The turnover. Uh, a year later, we're here now, we can't really be sharing our turnover on a regular basis because, yeah, we've got an accountant for that and, you know, turning money over is one thing, making profit. If you, if you share what you turn over, people probably think you're making lots of money, but that's not the reality, no. is it? But what we can say is we've come a long way in the first year, I think. What do you think? So we're going to share some numbers of like items, what we've sold. Yeah, and it what might is the uh, the most the best the seller best sellers day. and stuff like that. Let's go with January. Can't go with the best and items. I'm going to put it on the screen so you can see. But I'll blur out the money. <laughs> so we sold 80 full breakfasts, 42 baddie breakfasts. This was Maybell's dish. You put on the. Menu. Avocado. Mash avocado poached eggs, 74 dishes sold. Latte, 120. Americano, 109. Small breakfast, 36. This is coming down in a money amounts. Yeah. The higher the money amount per item. Mango smoothie, 51. As you can see, chicken steak goes on and on. All these different things. We have got quite an extensive menu here, haven't we? <laughs> British teapot, 51. Yeah. I remember that on January we we not that busy but still still you know the best seller still. is still full breakfast eighty dishes that's good mm. but we we not busy wasn't that busy no. yeah okay let's jump let's stop messing around let's jump to a busy month maybe <laughs> not April March we'll go for March. March we sold 86 full breakfast, 33 baddies, 62 poached eggs. Okay, now you see where we have the barbecues that made a, made a difference because 35 Wagyu beef burgers, latte, 126, cappuccino, beef steak baguette, that's from the barbecue, small breakfast, 51, singer, 88. Obviously, the beer sales went up because we had evening opening. Yeah. 
Americana, strawberry daiquiri. Was that you on the daiquiris? <laughs> Barbecue ribs, mojito, French fries, Mai Tai, Leo. Yeah, you can see the months where we have the barbecue the takings go up obviously house wine you know but this will all be the alcohol that we sell on the barbecue we haven't had on the menu it's going on the menu now all day so yeah and it will come back the evening opening will come back so that's just a couple of months as you can see look the list goes on and on and on Mabel flat white 41 that's me Heineken that could be me Water, oh, the beer 171. <laughs> well, my items aren't even on here. Should, should I put my items on the on the? Someone said we should. I remember in the in the in the older videos, people were saying I should put my items through the till, and you as well. Mm. Mosquito. Yeah. So that's some of the numbers, guys. You know, our customers mostly come from YouTube. Mostly our subscribers, but also local people in the area and local tourist holiday people looking on Google Maps to find where to go to eat. Google Maps is the one. We advertise on Google Maps and yeah, it's pretty good, right? Yeah. That's day one, done and dusted. Not a bad start of the week. Maybell's Coffee Garden plants are coming on nicely. We plan on growing Bougainville up the coconut trees. Not sure if that will work. We'll keep you posted. Avocados coming on nicely. Good morning. Wednesday morning. Uh, we woke up to complete downpour and now the sun is shining. <laughs> Hopefully it stays like this but yeah, that usually happens here a lot. Uh, rains early in the morning or sunset. So hopefully it's clear through the day. So yesterday we covered the business quite a bit. And today we're going to talk about YouTube. The YouTube business. Here's Jay doing his famous dance. <laughs> hey, the, the plants are coming on in our place. Have you seen some of our old videos now you struggle to see into the garden so yeah today I want to share more about the YouTube business what we're doing I'm working on something in the background uh, some people won't like it some people don't like you trying to make money here and hey we all need to make money in life but working on something pretty good and yeah I think it'll yeah it looks all right it looks good so far I'll share some of that later after the morning shift in the coffee shop uh, yesterday one of our neighbours came in and said he's, he wants to rent his house out. So there's our shop. Uh, big Buddha up there behind me. This way is towards Kata Beach. I showed some property here before. Kata Top View. So this is the house here behind me. It's three storey. I think in the UK we call this a kind of townhouse. I'll call it an island house. Cause it's got a beautiful sea view. Swimming pool. It's huge. I'm going to just take you in and show you. We'll do a voiceover here. It's best, easier to show you around the property. Let's go in and have a look. Okay, let's go in and check this out. Nice big door going straight into your nice sitting dining room. The thing I noticed was the sides, very big. Beautiful wooden floors, side windows letting in the light. Balcony overlooking the communal pool, very nice and clean. I did notice everywhere was clean around here. Downstairs toilet, come in handy. And then into your kitchen. Everything you need in your kitchen here. Everything to cook up a storm. Very nice. Then up the stairs, very wide staircase. So much feeling of space in these houses. Good sized master bedroom with a decent balcony. The views get better the higher you go on this. This is a three floor house by the way. Let's go into the master bathroom, very good size, big shower, well done, nice bath with a great view, very nice, yeah very well done. Then two more bedrooms on this floor, two double bedrooms sharing this very nice bathroom. Both bedrooms have a nice little balcony with this beautiful mountain view, very green. 
yeah, it's all very well done. Up to the top floor, this is where the magic happens. Check out this second sitting room, maybe you could call it a sunroom, with a balcony and this awesome view of Kata Beach. Just check that out. And then Big Buddha, the mountain on the side. Beautiful room, I could spend my days up here I believe. Just taking in that view, very nice indeed. Then you go through on this top floor, there's another shower room. Well done. And the fourth bedroom, four bedrooms in total. Another balcony with great views out the back. Yeah, very nice house. So this is on offer now at 40,000 baht a month until December. You can have this big, beautiful property for only 40,000 baht a month. So that's the house. Wow. I'm sweating now. So big. Yeah. I videoed these before and I said I would like one at some point. Because you can really make it. Yeah, it's like a home. It's a big house with them sea views. I love it. And this area is so nice and quiet around here. And you've got great coffee on your doorstep. What more do you want? Okay, good afternoon. Welcome to my office. <laughs> so we've done the we've done the morning shift, Maybell's Coffee Garden. Pretty quiet, you know, it's low season. And I think that's the that's the that's really the thing here that you have to get used to, having a low and high season not used to that kind of thing being from the UK but I'd say next year, this year sorry, we have to be ready for high season. We have to hit the ground running and really pump it for five months, you know, evening opening, parties, barbecues, you name it. <laughs> and then we might be able to do a bit more YouTube. Right now I want to chat a bit about YouTube, what we're doing and yeah, we're trying to make a video a week at the minute or maybe even two a week, depending on how busy we are. Anything less than a video a week I think is not enough. Views going down steadily. <laughs> Money averaging the same. Around £600 a month for us at the moment. And it's needed. Definitely having a business here. What's wrong with Pussycat? Definitely having a business here is, is a blessing that we have uh, the coffee shop and YouTube because trust me, we really need this money sometime. Uh, just a little thing about a recent video we made. Is marijuana really legal in Thailand? <laughs> this video was... Uh, I'm a bit upset, but I don't usually get upset about things, but... I thought this was going to take off. It looked like it was going to take off. Analytics showed it was going that way. And then it got put, boom, to a halt. Thanks to YouTube. Thank you, guys. Yeah. So it was going up and up and up. And then we got an age restriction and a demonetization. Well, not completely demonetized. Limited to no ads. Another one like the Bangla Road one. You know. Are they getting picky on YouTube? Because we were only sharing the law. The, the new rules but maybe it <clears throat> glorifies marijuana for younger people but <clears throat> we wasn't saying take it we we're just saying this is what's available now in Thailand but anyway yeah that's the little bit about YouTube I want to show you what I've been working on in the background and what will be coming soon I've not finished it yet and I'm, I'm a little bit of a perfectionist but not completely I just like to have things working properly so I had a few requests for like a consultation video chat with people regarding moving to Phuket areas of Phuket business in Phuket and I wasn't really ready to do it but now I feel a, now I feel more ready and I've set up this mini website you've probably heard of Linktree Linktree has become very popular but now there's all these other ones that are maybe better more ways, more things you can do. I call it a mini website. Because we don't need a full on website for our YouTube channel. We want to link and direct you to other services that we will be providing. And one of them will be 
a video chat consultation about anything you want to know about Phuket, Thailand, living here, doing a business here, visas, and YouTube if, if that's what you're interested in. Uh, other products I'm now working on, that's why I don't want to put it out until it's fully ready. Uh, we'll have a monthly video there where it's completely separate from YouTube and it will just be like one dollar to watch this video rather than asking you to become a member on YouTube you can just pay one dollar to watch this video a month a month maybe maybe it won't be every month still working on these ideas we want some input from you guys what would you like to see on there we have affiliate links our friends motorbike business where you will get 10% off the money exchange with the, the company we use uh, and other stuff like this the main thing I want on there which I'm working on now is a video course a video course on how I film and edit 90% is done on my iPhone the editing done on my iPhone the videoing the cutting and putting it all together as one final video is done on my iPhone the rest is done on the laptop audio and upload that's it audio and upload on the laptop so I want to make a video course on this and a video course on Hey look, we're not that big YouTubers, 22,000 subscribers, we're growing steady, but we're here based in Phuket, if we, it would be nice now to take a trip somewhere because you take a little trip out of Thailand, Phuket is old news at the moment because everyone's been here, everyone's been vlogging in Thailand because this was the place that was open, now everywhere has opened up, it's good, you know, it gets a good hit because it's different, it's new, people want to see everywhere else open as well. But we're here, we're, we're a Phuket based vlogging channel. So let us know what you think, what would you like to see on there. That's a little update on YouTube. Uh, just me today guys, maybe I was sick. Give her a little comment, get well soon. She's got a temperature. The soldier is down. She's been a good soldier for the last two years. She'll be back soon, I believe. <laughs> <laughs> we finished the day sampling some new dishes in Maybell's coffee garden. Sorry Maybell, you're going to have to go back to the drawing board with that menu. <laughs> Chocolate lava cake, mmm. Wow, look at that, interesting. Okay, this one's coming to an end guys and we brought you here to Promthep Cape because Somewhere in the title it's going to say tropical island, so we best show that we actually are living on a tropical island. Yes. Aren't we Mabel? It's a big tropical island, so let's wrap it up. Uh, we did a bit about update on the business, update on YouTube, something new things coming soon, we'll let you know. And yeah, low season, high and low season. It's definitely low season now, eh? Yeah. We're, we're reducing things down at the moment aren't we to get through this low season hopefully the first of July changes might bring more bring more people, people. do no masks from now on that's good that, I like it yeah that changed overnight uh, first of July no tie pass so hopefully they'll come in even though it's low season <laughs> okay guys that's it thanks for watching take care peace goodbye, goodbye.